Welcome to Stockholm. We are so delighted to have you here. I came across some of your stories in the college journal, beautifully written. Joe had a very heavy hand as a teacher. Did he encourage you to keep writing? A writer writes because he has something personal to say. You write with intelligence, but you're detached. The characters are supposed to be detached, especially the mother. My wife doesn't write, thank God. Otherwise, I'd suffer permanent writer's lock. <laughs> Don't ever think that you can get their approval. Who's? The men. The ones who decide who gets to be taken seriously. A writer has to write. A writer has to be read, honey. I think it's the beauty of the film is that it's complex. It's not easy to say, I like this guy more than that guy. John, I hope you know that uh, his affairs have nothing to do with you. That's a compulsion. I believe it's a deep-seated fear of inadequacy. The scene between me and Glenn, I thought, had a nice back-and-forth quality to it. There was definitely an investigative journalist quality and uh, you know, a little relentlessness and a little aggressiveness. Well, I was out being a drunken lush. You were seducing the luscious Linnea. Nothing happened. Oh, don't you dare insult my intelligence. Don't you dare. They both are very complicit in whatever their life becomes. I think in the early scenes when she says, I know how to fix it, you know, um, she's doing that because she loves him. Uh, she doesn't want to lose him. Mrs. Castleman. Yes. You should know that your husband will be sending off the press today, so what I advise is that you monitor his calls as it does get quite exhausting. Yes. I'll take good care of him. What happens between these two people is that it, they're, they're complicit. It's a decision they both make. He can be seen as a bad guy because he suppresses his wife in the public eye. But there's a reason for that. I see I'm going to have to watch out for you. <laughs> I could be quite a handful, Professor. Love is an incredibly complex thing that I think as, you know, as a society we're still trying to figure out. Love, um, passion, and also the importance of truth, I think, all come into play. Joan, we're not bad people. I think you are sick and tired of Joe Castleman. I would like to convey to you the warm congratulations of the Swedish Academy. You have reinvented the very nature of storytelling. Tell me about yourself. Do you have an occupation? I do. And what is that? I am a kingmaker.